So I got this um, Cuisinart rotating uh, rotisserie oven for $10 last year, and I bought some pickling salt. I have a toaster, of course. And this thing was $10, and it works fine. The clip fell down inside, and I have to have another one on my uh, windowsill that fell out of something else. And if I get it just right, the door will stay shut, and it's got a light and everything. It rotates. For $10, I got this appliance that somebody just gave away. It's brand new. There was no uh, residue of food in there that I could see. I cleaned it out. And um, Robert's co-workers at Wex were so kind to me. And I I checked in, thanked them. And I the his supervisor, I can't remember her name, came um, here to get his computer. And they had already sent me a beautiful bouquet of lilies and stuff. So kind. And um, we have FedEx even. And they got me a $400 Walmart gift card. So last fall or before Christmas, I went and got myself this little handheld KitchenAid um, because I always wanted one. I, when I was uh, going through my divorce after my abusive relationship, I was very isolated because my family ostracized me up the road and they all kind of, everybody's like, oh, she did it to herself kind of stuff. And they don't understand when people are growing up in a place that's repressing you and ostracizing you and there's no jobs to be found you don't have a car you're broke because you've been financially abused by your ex-husband what are you going to do be depressed and then if you're living with a less than stellar brother and a mother who is not properly medicated and a father who is kind they're kind people they're good people but um I was depressed and I was very hurt that my older brother and sister-in-law just kept driving past and nobody even came and patted me on the butt and gave me a hug and said it'll be all right or nothing not well not one finger to help because they couldn't stand to be be there because they said my mom and dad drank well they quit drinking so then what all oh, because Tom drank why wasn't somebody there for Tom like Nicole Kidman was there for her husband Keith Urban why didn't somebody do something and step in and be kind and say, you got to get help? Why didn't somebody give Tom dental insurance? Because it's just too expensive. But they had dental insurance. So if you can't afford to insure people and pay them properly, then I guess you shouldn't be in business. Because we got hummingbirds and all that in Maine too, except we're kind to each other and we don't judge each other like the Midwest people. So I'll tell you what, you stay over there. And I'll stay over here with my $10 Cuisinart and my pickling and candy salt and my can of jars. Of, I'm going to learn how to can. And don't you ever put my name in your mouth. I ain't going to slap you over it. But if you want to talk about me, you come here and talk to my face, not behind a computer screen or a phone. Because that's just disrespectful and so is your entire family disrespectful and mean and cruel. And mean people suck.